hello good morning all today in this video we are going to discuss regarding odu 14 credit limit module that we have released recently in the odu app store so here in the odu app store you can see we have released a new module which adds the functionality of credit limit in odu and the module is available from version 13 version 14 and in version 15 so what i'm going to do here is that i'll be just explaining you the working of this module so i have already added this module into my add-ons path so if i go to the apps menu and if you search the credit limit if you search credit you can spot this module so i'm illustrating the module working in odu version 14 so this is odu version 14 community edition where i have downloaded this module and added into my odu instance so what i will do is that i will install this module so i'll click on install and let's see how the module works so you can see the module has been unsuccessfully installed now what you have to do if you go to the accounting and if you go to configuration and then to the settings you will have the option to enable the credit limit you can see sales credit limit and you can see trigger alerts when creating invoice and sale orders for a partner with a total receivable amount exceeding a limit so once you install this module you will have this option so once you activate this option only this functionality will work in your database so first of all come to accounting or invoicing then to its configuration settings and you have to enable this so once you enable this it will ask you for the default credit limit so if you set it as zero then it means there is no limit suppose i'll set 5000 indian rupees as the default credit limit and i will save this so i have activated that functionality in my database and right now when i try to invoice a customer who having a pending amount more than the limit it will show you a warning so let's see how this work so currently i have set the accounting setting my default credit limit is 5000 and if i go to invoicing so before that i'll create a new customer so i'll create a new customer as test and let me save it and let me mark it as customer so we don't have the option in oru 14 we don't need to mark it as customer so i have created a customer now what i will do i'll go to invoice and if you try to create an invoice for the test customer everything is okay i'll choose a product and i'll set the amount as 4000 which is less than the due amount or i'll put it as a 6000 and click on save and i'll confirm this invoice so right now we have invoiced the test customer an amount which is more than the limit which is 5000 so everything goes good there is no problem so far but the customer already has exceeded the allowed limit and if you try to create a new invoice so if you try to create a new invoice for the same customer that is test you can see you have a warning this customer has reached his credit limit of 5000 total amount due is 6300 so the system is saying that it, the, it ha the customer is exceeding the set limit and the due amount is 6300 and let's see what if he has made some payments so here he has an earlier invoice for 6300 including the tax and let's assume he is paying some amount maybe around a thousand rupees so he's gonna pay a thousand rupees and if you create a payment partial and if you come back and if you try to create an invoice again still it will show here you can see the due amount is 5300 and if you open the customer form the same customer form from the customers and inside the sales and purchase sorry if you go to accounting you can see the option total receivable so here you can see the pending amount that is total receivable from this customer is 5300 and you will see a credit limit 
from here that is this credit limit will be coming from the general configuration that is inside this configuration we have set the default credit limit as 5000 and let's assume where you have to overwrite the default credit limit for a particular customer suppose this test customer is a trustable customer we can increase his credit that is I have increased one more zero that is I am setting his credit limit is 50,000 instead of 5,000 that is four zeros and I will save just I have increased his credit limit to 50,000 whereas the general settings is general limit is 5,000. So if you try to create invoice again you will not see that warning you can see the warning is not coming because we have increased his credit limit and if you come back to customers itself if you come back to customers and if i change it to 4000 or you can even put a less amount like for this customer we have to give only till 4000 so the priority will be the amount that you have set inside the customer then only it will take from the general settings so i have set it back to 4000 and if you come to invoice and if you try to create invoice the warning will be shown here and if you go back to the customers itself and suppose if you need no need to set a limit for a particular customer like we don't need to limit him then you can set zero you can see if you set it as zero it means here you can see the field help a limit of zero means there is no limit that is if you set zero means this customer doesn't have any restriction we can give x or n amount of credit to this customer and if you need to set the default limit for this customer you can put a minus one minus one will set the default value from the accounting configuration so if i save minus one you can see it is coming from the default settings so the same you can see from sales application also so right now we have tested from invoice so if you go to sale order let me refresh that bubble if you go to sales and if you try to create a sale order for the same customer that is test the warning will be displayed here so this is the working of our credit limit module that is you have to download and install the module and you have to activate it from accounting settings accounting configuration settings you will have the options of sales credit limit default credit limit then you can override it from the customer master just go to the accounting tab you will have total receivable amount will be shown and you can set the credit limit zero means there is no limit and if you set minus one it will take the value from the accounting configuration and the module is available in Odoo version 14, 13 and 15. We will try to backport into version 12 also. So just download and use this module and let us know your feedback. You can drop an email to odoomates at gmail.com or you can directly add your ratings and review for our module in the Odoo app store itself. So that's it for the day. Have a nice day. Thank you.